Ah, uh, hello everyone, and welcome back to the White Wolf of Icicle Creek. Um, I'm recording this at like 8 in the morning on a Saturday, so if I sound really tired, it's because I am. Um, sorry I've been kind of neglecting this for the week, but uh, I've been working night shift at work for the last week, and it's so fucking hard to do anything during night shift. Everyone fucking hates it. Just destroys everyone, so... Yeah, sorry about that, but yeah, let's see what we can do. I kind of forget where I'm at, actually, quite honestly. Introduce myself That's to the finished. guests. Guadalupe finally fucking showed up, so we can do that. You know, look out for the bone, the two missing pictures we haven't found yet. Look around the Check. ice fishing shack, go and catch... Oh, right, still we still gotta to catch a stupid pike. Call the number on the papers. Win a snowball fight. That's finished. Yeah. Okay, so we can call the number on the paper and figure out what the fuck is going on. Hey, little Miss Fisherman. What can I do for you? Well, I better get back to work. See you later. Get out of here, Bill. What's up? Nice talking to you. Rock and roll. Yeah, indeed. We all love it, don't we? Don't we, Lou? Oh yeah, let's go see. I don't have to cook anytime soon. I don't think so. Okay, let's go call people. I gotta call Tino, I think, at some point, too. <sighs> Where was the number? Yeah, okay. Maybe it's under clues. Okay. Who helped me figure out who... Oh, there we go. Is it Run and Grow Free? Is that who it was? I'm gonna assume it's Run and Grow Free. I hope I didn't have to put a one in front of that shit. Hello? You have reached Run and Grow Free, a oh, non-profit okay. organization dedicated to making sure that the wild animals of North America remain wild. Uh -huh. No one can take your call at the moment because all of No one can take your call in the moment because we're all in the fucking can. All taking shits. In order to protect our cougar, bear, and mm. condor populations. But if you leave your name and number after the beep, someone will eventually get back to you. Especially if you want to make a donation. Give me give us that cash. So they got we got absolutely nowhere with that. We might as well call Tino, I suppose, while we're here, as much as we don't want to. Tino, my man, what have you been up to since, um, last train? What have you been busy? Hey, I was wondering when your number there was gonna show up on caller ID. Fucking creep. Ah, it's Tino. You're I'm the one who sure found the outhouse, the right I think, word, if Babbage. I remember right. Please, call me Tino. In call me fact, dick. Tino, I'm a little surprised you're still in law enforcement, considering some of the unethical, if not illegal, stunts you Ooh, calling him out, I like it. I like it at all. all behind me. Ancient history. Water under the bridge. So, looks like we're gonna be working together on I'm pretty sure you have to call him because looks there's like something you gotta do for him to advance the plot, which is literally the only reason I'm calling him. Oh god. How can he solve this from, like, long distance? I don't understand. Does, does he not have to talk to the suspects? I'm curious, how do you know like, Chantal? I don't know. If she was this into this guy, like, why didn't she just bring him to the lodge instead of us? It seems like a weird decision. I mean, it was the right decision, but it seems strange. How many clients do you have? I have enough. I have zero. Crime out my asshole. Nope, I'm good. Chantel hired me to be at your disposal, so you know where to find me. Arriva Dirty. Bye. Fuck off, Tino. Yeah, so like he he does something later in the game where you actually have to call him. Like that's literally the only reason I'm calling him is because I'm you I'm pretty sure there's something you have to do for him later in the game. 
that you need to do to advance the story a little bit further, so... Eh. You gotta deal with Tino, unfortunately. Speaking of dealing with people... Just walk past, for the love of God. Why does this kid force you to play this every single time? You think she'd learn that just getting hit in the face with snowballs over and over again isn't fun. Like, this can't be an enjoyable experience. She just takes ice-cold snowballs in the face ten times in a row. Every single time. I don't know. I don't know what kind of enjoyment she gets out of it, because she sucks at snowball fights. I'm starting to get really cold. Yeah, just get in, get in the shack. Quit whining. Quit whining and catch this stupid fish. Okay, let's see if I remember how to do this. I think you just click. That's not, not what a, I need. That's not a pipe. It's a walleye. Throw it back. Uh, so yeah. No, that's a white fish. Get out of my face. None of these are what I need. If you see trash, uh, I think you gotta avoid it. There's a pike, but I can't get it because the fucking can's in the way. I think... Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think it can break your line, though, or at least some of it can, if you're not careful. Jesus, there's a lot of them. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, good. Uh, come on. Oh, come on! No, it is the Oh, it's the sturgeon. There goes my line. Okay. It's the sturgeons. It's the sturgeons you gotta avoid, but you have unlimited line, to my knowledge, so... God damn it! I'm terrible. And logs? Shit! Log. There goes my line. This is bullshit. This puzzle sucks. I can't catch a single pike. Okay. Close, but no cigar. Damn it. I could be here a while. This is worse than the fishing in Kapu Cave. Get it down. No! Uh oh, the sturgeon ate my line. Why would a sturgeon do that? They don't eat lines, they're bottom feeders. Jesus. I'm terrible at this. I don't even know what the hell those big brown fish are. Oh, how did you? My line just bit the dust. Fucking Christ! This is so specific. This is way too specific for a dumb game like this. No. A sturgeon. <laughs> there goes my line. How am I supposed to actually do this when there's so many fucking sturgeons and fucking landmines in the water? Two feet, but not a northern pike. Two foot whitefish isn't bad. No, get out of here. Like, why am I fishing in a place where there's mines in the water? Like, are you serious? What? How does that not? Oh my god. I snagged a log. There goes this my This sucks. This fucking sucks. I'm sorry. I don't remember it being this awful. You have to be so goddamn. Oh. Not what I need. Good God. Just float a big ass pike. Ah, oh, there's a fucking sturgeon again. Just float a pike right near the top of the water. That's all I ask. I'm not even gonna try for that one. There we go. Thank a two foot fuck. northern pike. No more fishing for me. Thank fuck. That was way worse than it needed to be. Okay, you can't even fish again. Perfect. There's actually also an Easter egg you can get down there. I believe you can still get it. I'm hoping so. Anyway. Oh, Jesus. That explosion sounded like garbage. Also, that guy must have been whipping that snowball like a hundred miles an hour for it to knock us out. Oh my gosh. Whoever threw that ice ball at me must have set off an explosion that shattered the ice. And my Holy jacket's shit. gone. No wonder I'm so cold. How did that happen? Did he just take off your jacket? 
Did it blow off your body in the explosion? If if it was that powerful to blow your jacket oh, clean off your body, I'm pretty shit. sure you'd be dead. Ice boat to ice boat and put on that coat before I freeze to death. Oh god, this stupid shit. So like, I'm, this is I'm pretty sure like. Are you dick? Ugh. Can I not get there? Do they reappear or am I just fucked? What am I supposed to do? I'm unsure of what to do here. Oh, they do reappear. Okay. Well, come back to me. Is that close enough to make it to the thing? No, of course not. Come on, appear. And why does Nancy look like she has red hair on this? It's supposed to be Titan blonde or something like that. I swear to God. You just hop around for ages trying to wait for this there. Stupid thing to appear. Get your damn coat. Oh, I don't know whose this is or why that wolf left it here. Just put it on. At least now I won't freeze to death. Ah, it, warm again. It wouldn't There's really make you one that of the warm. Pockets. Whoa. Weird shit. Since I can't go back the way I came, maybe these tracks will lead me to shelter. <sighs> Just wander out into the wilderness. Seems like a good idea. No, how did we get knocked out by a snowball? Even if it was like an ice ball, like fucking... Someone must have been whipping that thing like a hundred miles an hour. Avalanche Ridge. Ugh, not exactly reassuring. Like a hundred miles an hour. Ski we... tracks. Probably Yanni's. I bet if I follow them, I'll wind up back at the lodge. I don't want to go back to the lo Oh, shit, but it's lunchtime, isn't it? Ah, uh, fuck. Fine, I will go back to the lodge and make everyone their fucking quesadillas for lunch. I can't stop shivering. Oh, you're almost I need in to it. get in and out of the cold, like, soon. Jesus. Get your ass in the house. Ah, much better. I was really cold. Did I miss lunch? Because it's 1 p.m. I swear to God, I'll be so pissed off. Oh, fuck off. I'm gonna get in shit from Ollie or something. That's not my fault. I cannot be blamed Pick for this. Phone, Nancy. I cannot be blamed for this. The phone is not running. What? What, what does he mean, pick up the phone? What phone? What is he talking about? What is going on? Chantal's on the phone, Nancy. What? Is this a glitch? What's going on? She's not on the phone. Am I supposed to call her? Ah, fuck. This is weird. Yeah, because normally you get yelled at if you miss supper, but that was totally not my fault. That's bullshit. So I don't know what the fuck Ollie wants to talk to me about. I was busy. Hello? Hi, it's Nancy Drew. Did you ask Yanni about using his picture yet? Yes, but he said no. Darn. Well, what is going on? I better get back to work. Don't let me down, okay? Uh, whatever, I'm just gonna ignore Ollie entirely. Hey, Nancy, phone. There's no one on the phone. Ollie says he has uh. lunch. Your job, remember? Maybe you should just go to the kitchen right now. What the fuck? It suddenly jumped. Oh, that's bullshit. I was dying. I almost. Fuck this. Fuck lunch. Fuck supper. Fuck it all. This is so much trash. 
I almost fucking died. Like, that isn't an excuse to miss lunch. These people are shits. These people are all shit. Don't burn the fucking salmon. Two more salmon. Everyone's getting cold salmon. Two more salmon for Bill. Two salmon for Freddy. And I'm guessing Guadalupe doesn't want any. No. Salad, salad, salad. Okay. Fucking Christ. So now we're gonna have to wait till the next day to fucking investigate because they just immediately jumped us to six o'clock. Apparently we spent six hours in the kitchen. That's shit. Tell Chantel to get here and cook herself. So dumb. Nancy needs to grow a fucking spine sometimes and just tell people to eat shit. Cause that's garbage. I was out on the lake, nearly died. Cause somebody up. blew up the fucking- Like no one has any questions about why the lake no longer exists. It's just gone, people. There's no ice on the lake anymore, and no one has any idea why, and no one questions it. I wonder if we're still carrying that gross fish around, too. I hope so. So Bill can go know all the trouble we went through. Who puts anchovies on their salad? Fucking heathens. Fucking heathens. Oh, fuck. The mouse... Eat it again. I know that's wrong. I'm just throwing out my garbage. Because I don't want to recook the salmon again. The mouse accidentally clicked twice there. I didn't want it to. One tomato. Two spinach, two anchovies. Two. Two carrots, one, two, one cucumber, one carrot. Order up. God, you people. Why does everyone need to have a salad? Why can't someone just have salmon? And again, why is there not a salad bar? I still don't understand why there isn't a salad bar. I can cook the fucking salmon, just make a salad bar for these people, they can make their own goddamn salad if they need to be this specific about what's on it. Cucumbers, croutons. Like, it's way more efficient. This place runs terribly because people Order make up. dumb decisions like this. God. Spinach, two carrots, two cucumbers. I think that's three. I hope that's three. Order up. Good. Oh, Jesus, Freddy. How are you not like 200 pounds? You just consume everything in my kitchen. Everything. You're eating more than every grown man, grown man here. <laughs> that's, that's like, Jesus. And you're what, 10 years old? Like, holy crap. Order up. Two egg, three yellow pepper. I'm really sorry about these segments, people. It sucks, unfortunately. It's one of the few games where you have to do this. The other, I believe, is like Waverly Academy, where you have to like make snacks. But it's a lot easier because you're just making sandwiches. You're not cooking shit for these people. Two croutons, indeed. Okay. 
And now it's going to be too fucking late to do anything, so I'll just talk to the guests and go to bed. How can I help you? Why aren't That's you telling anybody about the Every lake tonight. that mysteriously disappeared? Someone like what you need. Tell people. I'll let you get back to work. If you need anything, just holler. The ice is gone. It seems like a big situation. How can I help no, I don't want to talk to you. You're honey. busy, so I'll let you go. Come back anytime. Oh yeah, you look real busy, honey. Doing the same exact thing you've been doing all fucking game. Guadalupe come out? No. The mysterious creature known as Guadalupe. Bill's gone. Everyone's gone to bed and I can't go outside because it's too cold out. Go outside in sub-zero temperatures? I don't think so. Eat shit. This is so stupid. I wonder if we'll get the mystical line. Where's the bathroom? I don't know. In order to get the Easter egg, you gotta keep using your bathroom until she says something about Mystico. I don't know if I wanna do it though. But you need to do it to get into the. Oh, oh god. Who, like, who made the sound effects for that? They're very realistic. Oh. Say something. That's not what I wanted you to say. Do we have to hear it or can we just call them? I wonder if we can just call them. She says call 1555 Mystico. M Y S T I C. Where's the O? O. But I wonder if you, they'll even allow you to call them before she said anything. I hope so. Come on. Come on. Is it 155 or 1 800? We'll try that. Someone pick up the phone, I swear to fucking God. Ah. Damn it. I'll maybe have to look that up for the next part. Because it does actually do a pretty cool little little cutscene eventually. It's how you get into the Shinnick room that's always locked. And she's not saying anything, so. It's how you get into this room here, because it's it's always locked for the entire game unless you do this specific task. No, I don't want to set it for eight. Set it for seven. No, 7 a.m. God. Yeah, I had a 15 minute quick lay down. Stupidity. What do you want? Oh, God. You messed with my rifle, didn't you? This I got. Why are we doing this at 7 in the morning? You're waking up the customers. What the fuck? It's from the wacko left wing wildlife gang that paid you to screw up my left wing. I missed that wolf. How dare you talk to me like that? I'm leaving this place right now. Good. You just got yourself an escort off the premises. Oh, okay, so I guess that's the last time we're seeing Guadalupe in person. Well, I don't have to do her laundry this morning. <laughs> okay, do I gotta make breakfast yet? I believe I do. Yeah. Hmm. So yeah, I guess we saw Guadalupe fucking once in person, and now she's just gone. So, no, why am I going down to the basement? So that's cool, I guess. God, all I'm doing is cooking in these sections. All I'm doing. At least... <laughs> Jesus. Someone cut me some slack. I think breakfast is honestly the worst meal. There's way too much to cook, and there's way too much to screw up. Three French toast, one Canadian bacon, one omelette. Two bacon, two spinach, one cheese. Two green peppers. And that's it. Good for you. 
Oh my god. Freddy just never stops. She's just a black hole that sucks in all food in the area. Bill, you're Order good. Up. One bacon, two spinach. God, like 80% of this playthrough has just been cooking so far. I'm so sick of it. Three green peppers. Don't burn any of the meat. And two olives. Well, and thank you. Thank you to Ollie, who doesn't want an omelet. I like you, Ollie. How does this guy want? Three French toast? Order up! Two, three, this is for Ollie. Look at that breakfast. Breakfast of champions Order right up. there. It's not a big breakfast eater. Two Canadian bacon. One bacon, one spinach, two green pepper. Put that on the grill. What do you want? Ah, one French toast, one Canadian bacon. Yanni's also a champion. Come on, cook. Jesus. Okay, I think you wanted one? Uh, two Canadian bacon. Okay, so you're Order good. Up. And you just wanted one? Perfect. Come on! So this I can just chuck in the garbage. Make it for yourself, Nancy. You haven't eaten breakfast since you got here. Okay. Let's talk about what we're doing. Can we talk to Ollie about why people got kicked out? And why we almost drowned in the lake? Oh! What you need. I couldn't help but overhear the argument. You sent her home. You sent her packing on. She messed up my rifle, so I couldn't shoot that wolf, so I tossed her. How'd she even get a hold of your rifle? Crusade somewhere else. Have you told Chantal that you threw her out? No, not yet. She's not gonna be happy. But by golly, that woman was a menace. She Anybody was a liberal. Sabotage a man's rifle is capable of anything. It is a pretty and shitty you know, thing to do, honestly, though. Wolf. And like I told her as I was giving her the bums rush. The bums Next rush. Time, I won't miss. I'll let you get back to work. Keep me posted. Huh. It is a pretty shitty thing to go messing with somebody's stuff. I don't even know how she got a hold of it. Like, why doesn't he keep it? You'd have to keep it locked in a safe, I think, here. Like, I'd, you're not allowed to just keep guns in the open, like, in the States up here. I don't understand how she would even get her hands on it. Unless Ollie was an idiot and just left it lying around somewhere. I don't know. Seems stupid. Bill's still not awake yet because he sucks. Um, okay. Is this just the note? Okay. Okay. Let's see if we can follow those wolf tracks at Avalanche Ridge. That's for me. That's me! Nancy, because of that Neanderthal of a handyman, I have been forced to return home. Please call me. When it comes to the White Wolf, there is much for us to talk about. Lupe. Yeah, okay. So I'll call her when I get back. So that's literally, uh, you, like I said, you talk to her once the entire game. And that's about it. Um, how do we get out to Avalanche Ridge? I think you gotta go to the Needle first. No, I don't wanna use this snowmobile. Uh, you literally see her once in person, I think. Maybe you can see her twice, but for most of the game, you're just talking to her over the phone. Which is stupid, but it is what it is, I guess. Okay, yeah. This is the way I want to go. So this is also why you need the toasty packs. Uh, if you don't have the toasty packs at this point in the game, there's no way you can get this far, because you'll freeze to death. Okay, where's... The, the cutoff here. No more avalanches for oh, me. Thank you very it's not, much. not the right direction. That's weird. The rock that had the oh. fossil in it is gone. Huh. We're just in the hole. Okay, I guess this isn't the right way to go. 
I don't know. I get lost easily in these back trails. The back country. I thought the other way just led back to, like, the bunkhouse, though, or something. Can we not? Yeah, we can't even go the other way. Okay, so I, s I guess this isn't the way to go. Because I don't think we can go back to the lake, because it's just a total shit show right now. Why aren't we freezing now? Ah, much better. I was really cold. Yeah, we all are. Okay, so it's not... Okay, I don't think we can leave. Is it past Freddy, maybe? Oh, maybe it's just out this way. Just out into the wilderness. Yeah, here we go. Here's where I wanted to go. So yeah, you can't go on to Avalanche Ridge. The snow's so deep, I'm oh, sinking up to off. my knees. God. If I want to follow those tracks, I'm going to need some snowshoes. I swear to God. Oh, I didn't know that actually killed you. Like that would bring an avalanche down on you. Bullshit. Bullshit. I'm calling bullshit Something on that. tells me I shouldn't be making this much noise. Not when I'm walking in a place called Avalanche Ridge. I don't think the sound of crunching boots is going to trigger an avalanche, Nancy. I don't think you're that loud. I can't stop shivering. I need to get in out of the cold, like, soon. Yeah, yeah. Why didn't you get that cold walking out there? 